All right, Shelvin. Well, j just got done first day, first game with the Red Claws. Tell me, what was it? What was it like getting out there? I know you didn't have much time to get acclimated, but it seemed like you fared pretty well. Uh, yeah, it was pretty good, especially you know being able to you know get released on Monday and be able to come out and play a game on Wednesday. You know, it was great. Uh, good to get my legs underneath of me. You know, kind of tough and kind of sick, but you know, it was great to get out here and play with these guys. Uh, what do you feel like is the most important things for you to show in order to, to get back into the NBA? I just keep doing what I'm doing. You know, this is a, a weird situation for me in Washington, which it didn't work out. You know, I was playing well, uh, and I've been playing well. So just keep doing the things I've been doing and just continue to you know, grow as a leader. It, it seemed like with the Washington Wizards, they said it was just more of, of a need thing, not that you weren't one of their top 15 guys. How, how tough was that to stomach? Um, it's tough, but it lets you know that the NBA is all about, uh, you know, the business. You know, sometimes the number of games, it just doesn't work out for me. But, you know, you just got to keep your head high and just keep working and look and just try to get better and land in a, you know, a better situation. How nice is it to have this opportunity to quickly be able to join with the D-League team and, and showcase what you can do in front of a lot of decision makers and scouts? Uh, it's great. It's a great opportunity, especially, you know, when you've been away. You know, some people don't have the opportunity to, to play and get back out there in front of the scouts and GMs as soon as I did, you know, 48 hours, and I'm out here playing. You know, so it's a great opportunity, but then also being with a, you know, a great organization and having great teammates, you know, just opening me back with welcome arms and letting me just go out there and play my game. Tell me a little bit about your, your teammates. I know it's important for a guard to have good weapons around you, and Dewan Summers right now is playing as well as anyone in the D-League. Uh, yeah, you know, he's playing great. You know, before I left, we was able to play some games together, uh, you know, get a little chemistry. You know, he's playing, gra uh, playing great. Just tell him to be aggressive. Uh, you know, and he's an NBA player as well, so just go out there and perform. Well, uh, a 10-day contracts can be signed now. Are you expecting to be in the D-League for long, or do you think you're going to have that call-up soon? Uh, you know, hopefully I'll have one soon, but I'm not too worried about it. Uh, you know, just play. Just day by day, and just try to get better each day. With the, with so many people that uh, scouts and GMs here, do you feel a lot of pressure in these games? Um, no, I wouldn't say so. You know, you've been I've been doing it for the past, you know, four or five years. You know, with AAU, you're playing in front of thousands of college coaches. Then, you know, college, you're still playing in front of GM. So I'm kind of used to it. You know, just a great opportunity for us to come out and play.